our next contestant, contestant number five, Lyra and Chloe. <laughs> one day, one day, Lyra and Chloe. Hi everyone. Hi everyone. Coming back to this venue has brought back many nostalgic memories. I think I just experienced my first sense of deja vu. True story. Eight years ago, I was standing on a similar stage here, taking part in my first storytelling competition organized by YMCA. Back then, no one expected our win. But as the youngest contender, I was also fearless with no care for jitters than ice cream I was promised later. Well, I came in second place, got my ice cream, and that event ignited my passion for public speaking. Fast forward to the present, I have to admit, I don't feel that fearless anymore. Two identical events, why the different mindsets? Remember how, when we were young, we all loved to play a game of what if? What if a genie can grant you three wishes? What if you can fly? Now, those hypothetical questions have morphed into something quite different as well. Mostly in the likes of, what if? I'm not good enough. Self-doubts can be our worst enemy. Besides fears, bouts of stress can eventually trap us, making us feel unmotivated or simply too tired to do anything. That feeling is like living inside a box on repeat mode. Sleep, study, eat, and replay. How many of you have felt jaded before? Once. I was trapped in that state for a while, until I joined my school's biodiversity program. Through nature, I was inspired by an insect. Wait a moment, don't laugh me yet. The insect's name is mayfly. Has anyone ever heard of the mayfly before? Their tribe has existed long before the great dinosaurs. What is fascinating is not how they survived for so long, but the fact that mayflies have an incredibly short lifespan. How short? The female ones live for just five minutes and the male ones may perish within one day. Yep, you heard me right. Just one day. In their short lifespan, they don't waste any time. They continue to mate and reproduce so they don't become extinct. They truly exemplify the phrase, living life to the fullest. Now, imagine this. What if you have only one day to live, just like the mayfly? Indeed, life is short. There is no time to waste on self-doubts. There is also no use in producing dozens of grand plans if you don't put them to action. The best plan without action is only but a mirage of castles in the air. Poof! They will never come to fruition. Just like the mayfly, some of us are about to emerge from our cocoons, getting ready to take flight to a new chapter of our lives. Everyone wants to live their best life. In our quest for the best life, whatever that means to you, let's remember the spirit of Mayfly. Stop worrying and start living. No more what if we can't. Focus on what we can. What ifs were meant to fuel our creativity. Don't let them become regrets. Instead, let's live fearlessly in the present moment and start taking positive steps for our future. Yesterday is what we had. Today is what we have. And the future is now. Our one day starts today. May all your dreams take flight. Thank you.